new video new hair <laughs> i should just like oh my gosh every single time i can't have a new look without new hair it makes me feel like a completely different person every time and it, it inspires my looks so. yes, yes. girl jada welcome back to another video we're doing another makeup look the usual and we're gonna chat just a little just a little bit more than the last time uh mostly about uh quarantine because we're still in it <laughs> and for me it's felt like forever but it's been what like two months that's a long time to be at home but more importantly, let's get into how it's been as a introvert. Because I think it's a misconception that like introverts are like, it's easy breezy lemon squeezy. We out here having a party at home like we usually do, like normal times. But honestly, it is just as draining in a, its own different weird way. It's a little, we'll get into it. And I have a, like two new products that I want to try, but I, I'm not going to talk too much about them because I do want to do like their own separate video review. Um, but we're just going to do a little try try. If I feel like it's necessary to really say something about it, then I will. But watch out for another video about reviewing some makeup. So let's get into this look. So to get started, I already have my eyebrows on like usual. And I already have my eyelids primed and concealed. So we're gonna get right into the shadow. We're gonna start off with the I Love Avocado palette. Haven't been back to this in a while. It's a fluffier brush. And we're gonna dip into... Let's start off with lime. Let's start off with lime. Dab into that. And we're gonna go start where I always start, which is the crease, a little bit above the crease of my eye. And I'm just patting that in. I've been really wanting to get back to this palette because this was a really cute palette. Anyways, let's, let's, let's get started in this little chit chat. So how has quarantine been for me? Honestly, the first few days were heaven. Like, I'm not even gonna lie. And and you know what? You know what? I wouldn't even say the first few days. I would say the first month was heaven. Like, I can't even lie, it was dope. Like, I didn't have to wake up super early to get ready for work. I don't even have to get ready. Like, it's awesome. I can get up, My I can be looking in any way. My hair can be any way. Um, it don't even matter because I don't I don't actually have to go to work, which is amazing. I think that anybody and everybody, whether you're an extrovert or an introvert, can agree that that's pretty dope. Trying to blend this up a little to my crease or to my um, brow bone, and um, I'm gonna do this very same thing to the other eye, like so. It looks very bright on camera because it's lime. It's like a super lime, granted, hint the name, the color. So I'm gonna then dip into guac, guacamole. And I'm gonna try to work that in beneath. Right, right beneath it. So like I was saying, it was pretty much heaven. And like I said, even for me, like the first month was even better because I fi come to find out that I was, I had more time, um, not only to like be goofing around or whatever, watching, catching up on Netflix or what have you, but also to pick up hobbies that I feel like kind of got away from me a little bit. Like it's crazy how much time it takes up, like, especially cause eh, my job's about 20 minutes or so away so it's like not super far but like dang like you know and you go to the grocery store after and so by the time you're getting home you might be like six seven and then you know you have to do it all over again the next day but like since it's almost like you get up straight at work and going 
in like going break straight at home and also being you know straight at home when you get off work is like nice so like i had definitely a lot more time i was writing more um i was or at least writing at all because i kind of dropped writing for a while um i should be making honestly more youtube videos but i haven't <laughs> um i'll get into that honestly um i was get able to game more i picked up pc gaming i haven't liked pc games in like a hot minute like a hot minute i was finishing games because lord knows i had like a backlog on games because uh i'm terrible and i usually try not to buy new games unless i finish old ones but we're not perfect here okay everybody makes mistakes i was been i've been able to read more also um which is also really nice it's just hobbies 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 like the first few weeks i was like Oh my gosh, let me catch up on this. Let me do this. Let me do this. Oh my gosh, I have time to do this. But I think the real issue kind of comes when like all of that has kind of run its course and then you're kind of now at the point where you're like, okay, uh, I did that and uh, that and uh, that. <laughs> now, surprise attack, we're gonna go into a completely different palette. We are gonna go into the one and only Patricia, as always. And we're gonna go into that nice teal rich rich I'll start at the ends i think with that like i said this is as much of a surprise to me as it is to you and that's like the real treasure in all of this you know surprises will this lip turn out trash You would know as well as I would. Go into the L'Oreal, this really small palette, and we're gonna dip into this blue right here. Do they have names? They do not, it's just shade three. Yikes. So, really, let's get into the definitions of introvert and extrovert, right? So, as an introvert, I draw my energy from being alone. That does not mean that every waking second of my life, I want to be alone. It's not, what, it's, not what, it's not what that means. It's not what it means. It just means that I am my most energized, I am my most refreshed when I've had time away from people. I can't be around people 24 seven. I would even go as far as to say, I work like an office job. So most of the time I'm not even really talking to people and that in of itself, being around people is still draining to me. It drains my energy and it makes me so like, I feel exhausted, right? That is what the true definition of it. Just like, so extroverts draw their energy from being around people, but, that being stated, we still need some reprieve from being alone. Okay? <laughs> okay. Like I'm not gonna like I'm not gonna sit here and say like it's definitely, 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 definitely easier me being an introvert and being in the situation than it is for my extroverted friends. Like I'm not gonna sit here and say that that's not the case. But I still need some kind of socialization if just for a day honestly if i got it for a day i probably could ride out the rest of this pandemic completely fine that's kind of how i work like i'm literally like 99.9 percent .9 introverted so but the fact that like i've literally had nothing has also been very um a eye-opening um definitely eye-opening because i really thought this is what i kind of wanted in a way 
and what I mean by not obviously not a pandemic but being like by myself day in and day out like I honestly genuinely was like oh, like this is what I've always wanted not realizing that that other side of me that social side of me was also necessary so that has taken that has honestly also taken its own sort of toll it's just the weirdest feeling i will find myself feeling extremely alone in circumstances that i usually wouldn't feel alone in which is like really 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 weird i've like i said since a month past the hobbies that i was so happy to get back into my life have now become already off the bat a little tiresome my other critique that i'm realizing about myself in this situation is my creativity has been shot like like i am not having nearly as many like creative moments that i i had and i don't know if that's because i usually draw my creativity from the outside world because usually that's not really the case but somehow i'm just i feel like more confined than I ever have in my life, which is really, 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 really weird. I'm just patting that. So I blended that out. So you can kind of see a blue gradient to green. And, um... It's starting to kind of look like the image that I was going for. I think... I could stop here. But I think I'm going to go in with shimmer just to add a little bit more. Just look, it's a relatively, supposed to be a relatively simple look. But um, I think I'm going to go into this Juvia's palette, Zulu. The Zulu. Mm -hmm. And go into the shimmery blue teal color right here and just put that in like my inner corner mostly. Mm -hmm. Like. Ooh. So I'm gonna get a, another fluffier brush kind of try to pat and move that to the locations that I want it to be moral of the video is just you know check on your friends whether they be an introvert or an extrovert because we all struggle on out here and we all you know need socialization even if it's just like for a second or a minute. Um, so it was nice that people are checking on me, but um, I said all of that crazy stuff to also say that I like, I'm, I'm doing okay though. Like everyone has ups and downs. I've had a few downs, I've had a few Quarantine cries. Let's be real. Let's get real a little, a little bit, a little bit. I'm lucky that honestly, um, a lot of my socialization can also I've realized, and I think it's just like a me thing because I've asked people this and they're like, yeah, no, that doesn't work for me, and I'm like, oh. But basically, like lives and like another hobby I picked up is like watching Twitch, so like. It's live, so like you can communicate with people real time, and that's kind of interesting. Same with like I know they were doing like a lot of like DJing party, house party club, Instagram party club things that I think is really also really nice. Um, like I said, I have some introverted friends that are literally just like, nah, that doesn't work. Like I need to literally be around people, and that's okay. Um, but you know. Y'all gotta compromise, <laughs> cause we ain't getting out of here uh, right now. 
So, um, I'm gonna also dip into, back into the Avo palette and meet this smash. It looks like really smashed. Pun not intended. No, it looks whack. It looks messed up AF. Hmm. It's relatively supposed to be a simple look. Like it was monochrome really. It was like a monochrome look, but I decided to add green just to give it a little bit more pizzazz. As I'm sure you're not surprised by my other content, unless you're new here and then hi, go check out my other videos. Um, but uh, simple looks really aren't my zhuzh. Um, maybe this feels, this sounds weird, but like I swear sometimes it just makes me feel lazy. Like oh, I can do more with that. Okay, not bad, not bad at all. Be right back, we're actually gonna do an occupation on video this time. But to be fair, I've been talking a lot, so I'll probably just like have to fast forward through it. We'll see. We'll see, I'll be back, I'll be back. <clears throat> so I'm gonna go in with my usual fave, most often used girl Fenty. You're just gonna Plop that on my face. Oh. And I, oh! So, your girl kind of forgot to put on my primer. So, I'm just going to put a few droplets of this on my face, too. We can put it on together. No biggie. No biggie. Okay. We Gucci. We going to use my blue booty bender. We can put a shower on my face. Can I also just say, like, I don't know if anyone else has had this issue or if it's just me because, like, my inner saboteur is uh, a doozy. But, like, one thing that has bothered me about this whole thing is, like, seeing some extroverts doing being an introvert, like, way better. Than me like that stuff is the stuff that I don't like does this make sense some extroverts are still living up let me just say and it made me feel some type of way like how I couldn't have been doing that at, in the comfort of my home this whole time huh having five-way skypes and stuff five-way Netflix and chill I'm like okay like I like those things like how come we couldn't do that before all this like Nah, y'all want to go with the club. Maybe every after all of this, people can be like, maybe everyone can like have a moment to like, extroverts can have a moment and be like, hey, you know what? I will stay in. And maybe, cause I know that for me as an introvert, it's made me kind of think like, you know what? Like, I need to go out, you know? Cause I'm so stuck inside. So I'm hoping that maybe it does this opposite for extroverts and we can just make this nice like, agreement where we're like hey you know go hit up your introvert friends when this is all over maybe hang out inside and also you know when this is over go hit up your extrovert friends and go out you know that's my plan hopefully we'll see <laughs> i've been like blending this for like an hour so then we're gonna go into of course the fenty concealer because sometimes we're very misunderstood. Sometimes we miss each other. Sometimes we miss out on one another because we might not share the same interests. Maybe you're upset because your one introverted friend always wants to stay in. And um, you know, maybe you're upset because your one extroverted friend always wants to go out. Maybe it's time that y'all appreciate one another and make the time to do both. That's all I'm saying. And let this dry. So now I'm gonna try out... I just got this in, oh my gosh, look how cute this is, isn't this the, oh my gosh, isn't this the cutest thing ever? 
it's beauty bakery it's their flower and powder i always wanted this and i was like another thing that um this quarantine has helped me with is definitely splurging on myself and like taking the time to actually buy the things that like i've been putting off buying for some reason <sighs> i don't know but oh my gosh look how pretty this is Oh my gosh, so excited to try this. Oh, so this is in the shade Plantain. So it's kind of like a yellow for like a deeper skin tone. Yikes. So uh, I just hit it and it got everywhere because I hate myself. <laughs> okay. This is why I don't deserve these things. Okay, well, um, okay, nice, 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 nice. So let's try this out. I got my beauty. Do y'all see the difference? Is that not just me? Ooh. Oh my gosh, my skin looks flawless. Am I tripping? Oh wow, that's nice. This is nice. Why did I wait? Oh my gosh, you guys, you can't tell me that my face is not flawless right now. I wouldn't believe you. I'm gonna use my Maybelline Stay Contour Stick. go into my lovely other fave the Fenty bronzer in the shade Mocha Mommy so next I'm gonna do lipstick so we're gonna use my NYX pencil and lip pencil in the shade Urban Cafe to line my lips A must-have shade for all chocolate ladies. <sighs> and I don't know, I'm feeling flirty. I usually would do a nude look. Like I, you know, that's like my go-to. But I'm thinking today, I am going to pull out a pink. I think I'm gonna pull out this really, really, really pink pink. And it's called Fuchsia Flash by Maybelline. It's very pink. I know. But I don't know, I like the contrast with the eye look, so we're gonna try it. So I kind of dig this, but I am gonna go a little smidge lighter with my NYX lingerie. This is what I usually would use for my nudes, but I'm just gonna put this in the very center. You can kind of see the light in the center. Hmm, it's not bad. Well, okay, I'm gonna go put on my lashes and we'll be right back. <laughs> Okie dokie. And this is the finished look. Yes, yes. Did I succeed? Let me know in the comments below if I succeeded. Or if I uh, miserably failed at this look and I should stop makeup forever. Let me know uh, that too. I tried out the product that I said I would try out. I don't know if you can tell where it is. If you can, kudos to you. I'm going to have a whole separate video for it, so I decided I'm not going to speak much on it. Not to mention, it's so minuscule what I used it for this time around that I really couldn't tell you how I feel about it anyways. Um, overall, I personally think that this is a success. Uh, I have the hair clips, I have the pink tails. What what more could you possibly want from this channel that you don't get? Come on. Um, I finished the look off with my highlight. The one that I love the most, the one that's from Patricia's palette. I love that. Ugh. Oh, and I used um, my baked powder. It's a really nice pink blush. I look like a blushing bride um, from Milani. Yes. So go check this out. It's really nice. Oh, so far, what I will say product review wise, 
this flower powder. I don't know why I waited so long to get this. My skin has never looked more flawless. No question. I already feel like this is a game changer for me. I am shook. Look at me. This erases pores. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. So I also got it in translucent. Um, so I will see how that is. Maybe next time. Maybe in my next video. I don't know how long this video is gonna be, so like I'm not gonna bore you with my long spiel. Y'all already know what it is. If you liked this video, don't forget to like it, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to your girl because uh, we're here creating content and uh, there's more to come as always. And ring that bell so that you're notified. Stay positive out there, stay strong, all my extroverted people, and you know, also stay strong with my introverted people, people because it's hard for us too. Follow your girl on Instagram so you can get more, if you want to see this look more closely, there will be photos, there's always photos, and I will see you all in the next one. Deuces. Don't mind me, I am doing a TikTok video. I am not proud of it, but y'all, y'all, everybody, and they mama wants it now, so I gotta give the people what they want. Follow me on TikTok. My name is JJ Danique. <laughs> Shameless post.